Hey guys, this is Shivam and I'm back with another video. In this video, I'm going to be talking about how to install Checkrin jailbreak on Linux and Windows. So finally, official version is released yesterday and uh, uh, this video is all about that. Uh, so this video is quite lengthy. Firstly, I'm going to be showing you how to install uh, Checkrin on your mobile. So so first phase uh, till seven minutes uh, it will be how to install Checkrin on your mobile and then the next uh, uh, after seven to 15 minutes that is uh, like how to install Linux on your Windows so method I'm showing that uh, you don't require any USB to install Linux uh, just simply install one software and uh, you know, we are good to go so before that learn how to install uh, uh, Checkrin on Linux so first thing first go to the Mozilla and uh, go to the checkrun dot, dot in and uh, there you can see multiple checkrun builds for different combination of operating system and architectures find out what's best for your system for me it's a uh, second one which is a uh, 86 uh, 64 bit version i'm gonna be downloading that and you can read this description and all that so uh, now this is the installation method for uh, linux so you can read this all now we need uh, this what is that using the repo so these commands we have to keep uh, we have to input in the run command uh, which is in the terminal so before that uh, the downloaded checker and app is, uh, we have to kept on the desktop that is very important step um, just copy and paste it on the desktop so once you've done that now go to the menu and search for terminal just open the terminal window now the very important step uh, just copy that repo and uh, paste it on your terminal run command once you paste it hit enter then it will require a password um, your linux password actually just provide the password mine is one two three four five six and hit enter then uh, we're gonna be needing the second command which i am putting wrong accidentally so you have to select entire command so do that correctly just copy and paste it and then hit enter then it will download something some few files uh, online make sure you are connected to the internet that is very important so now you can see it's downloaded some files then the next step will be copy this command and paste it and hit enter it will install few commands just wait for it you can see the installation progress then i can see some app list uh, um, you know something is there i want to see that so just i i enter that app list and uh, it will come app list then the very important step is type cd desktop and hit enter I, I kept uh, I put the wrong command actually the D should be the capital CD desktop and then hit enter once you've done that next command ch mode triple seven checkrin uh, space triple seven space checkrin so this is the command which will be um, just see it properly and uh, type it properly hit enter and then the next command will be sudo space dot full stop and uh, then uh, hit check run and then hit enter then what will happen it will detect the check run app from the desktop and it will pop up on your device now that is it uh, the main work has been done now you can see um, you can connect your device to the computer and simply trust it once you've done that you can see the um, mobile has been detected in that and you can see I'm running on 13.2.2 and uh, I already installed Checkrun on my system so you can see the CDI over there since it is unthreaded jailbreak so you have to, every time you restart your device you have to jailbreak it again you can go to the option you can allow your device here uh, so since I'm uh, already allowed so I can just simply hit the start button and next now we, the device will uh, turn into the uh, recovery mode so now the device is in recovery mode dfu mode so now you can see the 
uh, instruction came in front of you so read that instruction so in my case i have to um, you know press the home button and the power button at the same time and let go the power button after 4 second and holding the uh, home button for 10 seconds so now keep watching I'm, uh, i'll be showing you just hit start button and uh, power button and the home button at the same time let go the power button after 4 second keep holding the home button for 10 second and let go the home button after 10 second and you can see now the installation for chakran has been begin as you can see guys the mobile has been jailbreak with the chakran app finally on linux so and windows version it will reboot the device and you can see uh, now we are on the home button so as you can see uh, it will reboot that's why it will ask you again to trust your device but don't worry about it just go ahead and trust it since my mobile was already jailbroken so you can see some tweaks are already working and uh, let's wait for the chakran to download you can see right side somewhere chakran is just now downloaded so uncover was already installed so i i i was not using uncover actually so i just simply removed it i'm using chakran on this this is ios 13 you know that now you can see the chakran app over there and cd is already installed if in your case it might be not installed you go ahead and install there cd and then go ahead and install the tweaks so now you learn how to install the chakran so next step will be how to install uh, linux on your windows version so keep watch this video hello guys this is shivam and today's video is only for linux and windows user i'm going to be showing for linux user to install some tools to get prepared for chakran official jailbreak and also i'm going to show windows user that how you can get linux on windows and install usb mux d tools to get prepared for chakran jailbreak in my previous video i have shown you guys how to get mac os to get chakran jailbreak by using same method but now we no longer required mac os so the next step will be how you can get linux uh, on windows by using zubuntu process uh, so uh, watch it carefully the very first step will be uh, go to the you know bios mode by using your whatever system you are using you should know the commands uh, you will get on google uh, for me is f10 once you are once you are inside a setup utility then uh, go to system configuration and there uh, make sure you enable virtual virtualization technology something like that for my for me in hp so make make sure it's enable okay once you are enable just exit uh, with the f10 button and start the windows to check your system compatibility uh, go to run uh, type ms info 32 and hit hit okay then you can see uh, the system type should be uh, x64 base and uh, hyper v vm monitor and uh, something virtualization should be enabled if all else that means you are good to go one more important step uh, click on windows disk management and here you can see a c drive you know you need to create a partition drive to uh, install a new os on it so for that uh, right click on your c drive and uh, shrink volume and then type uh, around uh, 80 to something like 60 to 80 uh, gigs okay so i'm i'm going for the 100 gb once your drive is allocated just uh, create a volume and hit next and uh, keep the setup as it is ntfs just give it a name for your volume uh, and uh, it's okay and we are done here uh, partition drive is formatting and it will create a new uh, partition drive for us just uh, open it and there we go we got 100 gb uh, for our new os close everything go to internet chrome search for github.com slash brainstorm hit enter and click on it now you have brainstorm helper click on it and here go to resource and hit assets 
there we will get four four files which are we just gonna need the second file to run the program setup.exe file click on it and start installing it it will be around 1.37 gb it depends on your system and internet speed that how much time it will take it for me it took a while so our setup is completed so once setup is completed you will get Ubuntu installer and make sure you select your installation drive uh, for me it's a e drive which i created earlier as you can see uh, e drive which is which has 100 gigs next installation size i'm gonna select 64 gb and the device management will be zubuntu and language will be english username by default and hit provide the password easy way so the, so that you can understand because it's gonna need in future when we are installing Ubuntu and hit install it will start installation it will take a while so be patient I'm gonna speed up once it is done it will ask you to reboot your device hit finish When black window will appear, um, press shift to go to the, just go to the normal mode. Now the Ubuntu installation will proceed. It will, it will take some time to install. Let the process begin and be patient. It's almost going to finish and uh, this time it's installed and just hit that password which I put earlier now the Ubuntu has been installed and uh, that is the virtual machine uh, we are in the Linux based system in order to install checker and jailbreak on Linux or Windows uh, by installing Linux, you have to install USB Mux D on it. To do that, follow this process. If you already have a Linux, it may look different for you, but it will be the same process as um, on the Linux too. Uh, right now, I'm on Windows PC using Ubuntu, and I have installed Linux based uh, virtual machine. So, the same method we're gonna do for all. So, before we begin in terminal, we have to update apt-get to in order to run the program okay so type sudo space apt-get space update and hit enter then it's going to ask a password i'm going to provide mine to get permission so once you hit enter the installation the update will get update and you can see the package has been updated an update will be depends on how old your version is so it depends on that now to get check run, run on this device we need usb mux d tools to to device will be recognized in order to do that type sudo space apt uh, dash get space install usb mux d and hit install oops the command gone wrong so let's try again sudo space apt dash get uh, space install usb mux d and hit install now it will install uh, now as you can see it's already installed for me uh, because i have a newest version and if you have something the older version so you will get update it will get installed on your system so for me it's already installed as you can see in some cases let's say it's ask you uh, to to get install uh, type yes so to do that type sudo space apt the same same command and uh, there you can write uh, dash y so in this case you no longer required to type yes to install this command so go ahead and do that so as i said this is important without this tool you wouldn't be get check range jailbreak uh, that's what uh, nikias Besson tweeted uh, on twitter Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll catch you in the next video. This is Shivam signing off and it's always peace.